The DIY kit comes with these components. You get a uh, laser cut visor, you get four matrix driver boards, you get one control chip, you get one uh, voltage regulator, and you get one power PCB. So this is what comes with the kit. In order to complete the kit, you will need to buy a few other components. So you will need two 16 megahertz crystals, you will need three 22 picofarad capacitors, these are uh, 50 volt. You will need eight, eight uh, 0.1 50 volt capacitors, these are ceramic. You will need eight 10 microfarad capacitors, uh, these are, uh, I believe, yeah, these are 10 volt. You will need six 1K ohm resistors, these are quarter watt. You will need six 27K ohm resistors, or if you want, you could probably use 30K ohm resistors if you have a hard time finding these. You will need about 100 feet of um, 155 Celsius enameled wire. This is uh, 30 wire or 30 gauge wire here. You'll find this stuff on eBay. You will also need around 300 five millimeter red LEDs, and then you will need two six millimeter push buttons. And you will also need, uh, I have four here, but you need five of these Max 7219 chips. You also need uh, a four pin female header. You'll need a 3.3 volt logic converter. You need to get this one exactly. Um, they're sold by MD Fly. You can find these on eBay. You will also need uh, two four pin headers. These are just plain standard headers here. You will need a battery pack. And you will also need a Bluetooth module. And since I don't have one on hand, I'll just throw this image up. Okay? And uh, for the tools, you will need a soldering iron, wire strippers, scissors hot glue gun, some wire cutters, you also need some hot glue, and some solder. And one thing that I also didn't show was the 3 meters of Cat5 or Ethernet cable for making the interconnections.